As cool as it is, Tombstone is only the best known part of this area's rich frontier history. And there may be no one who has more fun showing it off than Arizona Bill. Touring the desert outside Tombstone with Arizona Bill is fascinating. There are all kinds of abandoned mining claims and the ruins of old ghost towns like here in Cortland, once a thriving mining community. We also saw the site of the ghost town of Pierce and Gleason with its long abandoned mercantile, the ruins of an old hospital, and the jail tree. They didn't have a jail here. So the constable would handcuff the prisoner, one cuff on his arm, the other cuff on this cable. Rain, shine, sleet, or snow, he was chained to this jail tree. Driving through the desert, you can see the signs of many a mining claim. People still come out here to prospect for gold, and some even find it. A lot of these northern people come out here, spend the winter, and they prospect all winter long. Most of the time, they'll find enough gold or whatever to justify the cost of their trip. Yeah. That's late. Yeah. I can tell. Back at the ranch that night, the hunt for gold continues at the poker table. Looks like Wyatt Earp himself is dealing the cards for a friendly play money game of Texas Hold'em, with instructions included. Well, this is Wyatt Earp. As far as teaching Texas Hold'em, I'm not sure anybody's learning, but so far we're having fun. One pin, two pin. Rookie That's gambler really Elsa was having a good run of beginner's luck. Nice job. Elsa. 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 Cleaning up on this night, a great way to wind up what had been a very fun day. <laughs> yeah, you're playing just a good. Oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> but there's more to come in the morning. Sunrise at Tombstone Monument Ranch. Horses quietly come to life in the corral as the warm rays of the sun light up the old frontier-style buildings and the historic monument in the desert. Soothing moments. One of the things I just love about Tombstone Monument Ranch is the peace and quiet. Love the horses, and it's great fun to experience the Old West, but it's also good for your soul to escape the madness out there for just a bit and enjoy the stillness of the desert. <laughs> Later, there'd be breakfast around the chuck wagon campfire with Arizona Bill. Thank you. All right, we ready? Give him a good kick and follow me. And the day's first ride. It feels like we're staying on a movie set. Steve and Katina McGrath are here from Connecticut and having a blast horseback in the desert. Oh, having a great time. This is just wonderful. You get the whole Western experience. <laughs> we just love it. But this is also the place to come for those who are serious about riding. Fast rides are offered here for those who can pass the fast ride test and the ranch offers lessons for newcomers who want to join that fun. It is cool to lope through the desert on the same trails where Wyatt, Doc, and the Apaches once rode. There's all kinds of terrain and lots to see, like an old abandoned railroad trestle, not far from the mystical petroglyphs left behind by the ancient peoples who once lived in this country. And even after the sun goes down, there was still more fun in store at the saloon. And the table's good place you bet. Where a good-natured pistol-packing dealer named Grumpy was presiding over a fake money, kid-friendly game, a pharaoh. Don't touch it yet. We win. Good job, okay? Quite a place, this Tombstone Monument Ranch. A place really like no other. A historic retreat that features the best of the modern world, a soothing break from all of its hassles, and some truly unique opportunities to step back into the past. And perhaps best of all, all kinds of great horseback riding for people of every ability level. No wonder people like our German friends come back time and again. I think I'll have to join them. 